Hello, we are with Brian from marketing team from Felder USA. Brian, how are you doing? I'm doing well. It's been a busy day. Uh, we have uh, three more days, two more days, I forget. Yes, correct. But uh, we have a long uh, week and uh, it's been exciting. Very we exciting. are talking on the second day of IWF 2024 and it's pretty busy today. Yeah. Uh, so far, it's we've had a lot of uh, traffic going in this way. Uh, I think yesterday we had more people on the sliding tables. Today, it looks like more people are interested in the heavy machinery. So it's really exciting. So what's new you have to cater for the... Uh, this year, we're presenting the fine brush. It's our big white belt sander. Um, it was released last year, but it's the first time here in the United States. And we're very excited. It's been very popular. Uh, we actually ran a few demos already. We had a piece this morning that was ran. Um, as you can see, it does a very good job. It uses brushes to get that nice finish, right? So it's been a, it's been a very popular, very popular uh, display. And we can run demos and yeah, people seem to like it. So tell me what, what else you have on the floor. So we have a range of edge banders, sliding table saws, joiner planers, CNC machines, big beam saws. Um, it's been generally, yeah, we have a range. Uh, typically we have, uh, we have three lines, Felder, Format 4, and Meyer. Those are like our high industrial machinery. So how important is IWF for you? I think IWF is very important to us because it's a way for us to connect to the people, uh, workers all around the world. We have people coming in. This is the largest, the biggest North America convention center for woodworkers. And we're so happy to be a part of it. We're always excited every two years that we do it. Um, it's very important to us because we get to display our machinery, connect with the people, uh, run demos that we can't normally demo because some of these machines we don't even have in our showrooms. But now's our chance to kind of display it. We have a team of techs, sales guys, product specialists that are just happy to give their knowledge. Uh, our guys have been training really hard and knowledgeable of the products. So we're just really happy to display it all for everyone. Okay, Brian, tell me something about the service you provide after sales, because that's very important for sure. the customer. Yeah, uh, I think our after sales service is really good. Um, if it's something like this, like a big machinery, we do typically do install. We have a service team that specifically helps you install the machine, calibrate it, and uh, do like training for a company. Usually uh, a small business or a big, a big business uh, they need training, right? They need to know how to use the machine and all that. So we offer chat support, phone support, uh, live in person for a couple days. Uh, and of course, if anything happens, give us a call and our service team is there to help out with any questions and uh, troubleshoot any issues. So I think, you know, we're always on top of it. So do you have uh, inventory of the parts in the USA? So our main headquarters is in Austria. Correct. Um, that's where a lot of our parts and uh, some equipment is, is over there. We do have a small parts in the U.S., which is in our headquarters in the U.S. is in Delaware. So we do keep in stock a few a few parts. But um, if it's a very niche part or very like, you know, we don't get a lot of uh, requests for those parts. We typically do not have it in our inventory. But it's just a you know a quick email or a phone call to our factory, and we can get it shipped. No problem. Brian, thank you so much for talking to us. Oh, thank you. Thank you for having me.